I have some shapes for us today. Will you help me sort them? There are two main groups of shapes. Some shapes are called flat shapes and the other shapes are called solid shapes. A flat shape is, well, flat. That means there's no depth to it. It doesn't have any thickness. I'll show you some shapes and you'll help me figure out if they are flat or solid. Okay, I have all my shapes over here. We're gonna start with this one. This shape, is it thick? No, there's not much to it that way. So we'd say this shape is flat. This is a flat shape. I'm gonna set it right here. Here's another shape. What about this one? Is this shape flat? If I turn it, is there some depth to it? Is it thick? Yes, it is. This is a solid shape. There we go. So we have flats and solids. I'm going to move the camera down so you can see my piles. Okay, flats, solids. Here's my next shape. What do you think of this shape? It's a solid. Okay, so that's where you need to tell me. Is it flat or solid? Okay, let's try this one. Flat or solid? It's flat. There we go. Flat or solid? Solid. Right, what else do we have? Here's one. Flat or solid? This one's flat. Flat or solid? This is a flat shape. Flat or solid? Solid. Flat or solid? Solid. Flat or solid? Flat. Flat or solid? This one is pretty flat her height. Some shapes are so flat like this. Look at this shape. See it here? The yellow part in the middle. It's so flat there's nothing, depth, no depth to it at all. This one is flat. But then this other piece of the same object, look at that. Hmm. This one? That's a solid piece. So it's kind of has some flat things and some solid parts. <laughs> it's a little tricky like that. So all shapes are either flat shapes or solid shapes. But that's not all there is. There are special words for different kinds of shapes. Today we're going to go over the words for some flat shapes. So bye solids, we're not going to worry about you for a while. We're going to go over some of the words for our flat shapes. You probably know these words. What shape is this? It's a circle. Circle. Do you see any circles around you? Look around. I see a circle right here. His eyes. His eyes are circles. Circle. Okay, keep looking. Now we're going to look for this shape. Triangle. Triangle. Do you see any triangles? I do. On his nose. He has a triangle nose. Good. Ooh, that made a lot of noise. Now, we have this shape. This shape and this shape are this, have the same name. This is the shape rectangle. Rectangle. Can you find any rectangles? Oh, I can. My paper right there is a rectangle. Doo, 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 doo. And then this is a special kind of rectangle. This is a rectangle, but it's also called a square. A square is a rectangle with four sides. Do you see any squares? Hmm. Well, if I look at just one part of this solid shape, 
and just look at the lid, the lid is a square. Ooh, this paper behind me is a square too. Those are the words, but what does each one mean? A circle is a shape that is round. It has no sides. Nothing's flat. There's no flat sides on the circle. The circle is round. The circle is flat, right? It doesn't have any thickness, but none of the edges are straight. A circle is round. Here is another circle. We see a yellow circle on here and then a bigger white circle. Circles. Circles have no straight sides. What about a triangle? How many sides does a triangle have? One, two, three. There are one, two, three sides to a triangle. A triangle has three sides. It also has three corners. Boink, boink, boink. A corner is called a vertice. And there are three vertices. Three vertices on a triangle. How many vertices on a triangle? One, two, three. Three vertices on a triangle. What about a rectangle? How many straight sides does a rectangle have? One, two, three, four. Four straight sides. How many vertices does a rectangle have? One, two, three, four. Four vertices. Four straight sides. Four vertices. Some people will call the vertices a corner. That's a good word too. All right, and then remember the square? A square is a rectangle. So just like a rectangle, it has four sides. One, two, three, four, and four vertices. One, two, three, four. But what makes it a little special is all the sides are the same. They're the same size. What's this shape? Oh, this is a hexagon. Did you know that word? Maybe not. A hexagon has six sides. One, two, three, four, five, six. Did you count that? Six. Six sides. Let's look at it again. I'll use a pencil to, or a pen to point at it. Okay, so here's the side. One, two, three, four, five, six sides. How many vertices does a hexagon have? I'll start counting from this one with my finger on top. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six vertices. A hexagon has six sides and six vertices. Those are the shapes. See if you can find some today. Bye class.